Hi friends. In this video, I am going to introduce you the TradeC Post software. I am opening the software. This is the main login screen of the software. Here, your company name will display here. You can click on that. The user section will come. The next is user section. You can select the user which you are logging. Enter the password for the user. Press enter. Then you can select the counter. Then press OK. It will be logged in into the software. This is the software interface. Okay. Here you can see the menu. These sections are options. And a key keypad will be the number pad and your total amount discount section here like what is the price sections and everything it will show here first i will uh, introduce you the options uh, button options here you can see customer the first one i'll show you the customer for selecting the customer name if there is any regular customer there you can add the customers and you can select the customer which one you want i'm selecting a customer then the customer name will come here automatically okay then the next option is employee if there is uh, so much uh, like four or five employees are there in your shop as a waiter you can select give the name for the waiters as employees or else anything you want whatever it's about you i'm here i'm selected as bill 1 bill 2 and bill 3 i'm selecting a employee it will come here then the next section is the products either you can and select from here like for hotels everything in the menu section will come here you can select from here itself the other section is row clear like what is that now? the option is if i am selected three items i want to delete the th second one from the row you can select the item just one click on that then you can press row clear button the item will be deleted from the list which you, which all products you are selected and this section is a bill discount option if you want to give the whole discount for the bill if i am giving a 10 percentage of whole discount for the bill it will be given each and every product it will be deducted 10 percentage of amount as a discount this one is clear screen clear screen means if i selected an item and the customer i in front of in front of us and they are selecting the items after that they said that just a second i will wait or else any any errors or any mistake or something you want to clear the screen what all you selected you can press clear the screen then they will ask a confirmation about do you want to clear do you want to really clear the screen or not you can press yes if you are confirmed with the thing then the row clear will be done all the customer employees and everything will be it's like a refreshing the section then here there is an option like quantity plus and minus quantity you can i'll show you the thing i am selected an item if you want to add up the quantity you can click on the item or else you can press from here you can see the option that quantity if you're clicking on that quantity plus then the quantity will be added up you can see now it's three I made four, five. It's like go there. If I want to, if we want to reduce the thing, you can also reduce from here also. Then this section is print bill, pay bill, and list. List is means when we done a KOT or a, any like bill or something. If whatever it is done from today, you, we can check the things as like we can uh, take the orders. What is that the thing? What is the order you done? And if you want to convert the bill and everything, it everything will be in under the list section. Here I'll show you the print bill and pay bill. Print bill means it's a pre bill. Like if I'm given an order to the kitchen and the if the item is delivered to the table, after the customer is finishing with having the food and all, after that they will ask for a bill to the waiter. So that we can give a print bill option. A print bill option. So it's a pre bill and it, the payment will not be done. So that the waiter can give that bill section to the customers as a pre bill so that after the uh, after when the customer is coming back to us you can take the uh, like customer can take that bill and uh, give to us and we can convert it to pay bill so that what will happens like the paying sections will be done pay bill is for directly paying the section all the tender sections and everything will come
then the, in page number two I will show you the, like there is an option like hold bill hold bill means if a customer came and they given an order and in suddenly they got a call or anything like a got a call or any friend is coming the customer will be lagged and if the other customer is waiting for us for any ordering section we can hold the bill you can give a message like any name if the customer we know the customer name we can give the customer name whatever you want i'm giving you c1 i'm giving c1 as the customer message and press ok that is gone to the next section as like the bill is holded then if the customer is back with the counter and they are continuing this order you can click on recall button here you can see recall here you can see the customer section you can click that one then what all selected what all items were selected before it will come automatically to the section uh, after that if, uh, the bill is uh, the section is confirmed you can give onto the kot here other options are there like keyboard log of settings and order type selecting order type selecting order type means if in our sections like in our firm there is two or three types of orders will be there sometimes table will be there takeaway will be there delivery will be there we can select on separate separate order type here the page number three page number three it's mainly like sales returns will be there if you want to give any sales returns option for hotels there will not be in sales return void of like cancelling the sections and uh, manage means it's a it's an option like for entering the data and all. Uh, in in another video, I'll I'll tell you how to enter the sections and everything, definitely. And this is the KOT scan. If we done a KOT like if we done a KOT order, uh, and after that the the customer is coming for uh, converting the bill like uh, order to the bill section, they are they are coming for the payments. Uh, if we know the KOT number, we can directly click on the KOT scan. They will come a box. We can click on the KOT number, then press OK. What is entered onto that KOT number? It will come here automatically. The items will come here automatically. And the page number four, it's about the like purchase payments and everything. These sections I will show you in the next video. And and the in the topper section i'll show you the thing split order it means if we done a kot if you want to order split an order you can use this one like oh if you want to change that section i'm doing a kot right now it's done and if i want to split an order like that giving the KOT now the KOT is done so order is done this is the one if I want to split an order like if these two items I want to send to another table we can select the table from here the table is selected this item I want to send to another table this to another table then press OK the items will be separated to the next sections then this is for complement because I, if I am selecting so much items if I am ordering so much items I am giving a thing like a biryani I am giving a fish biryani as a complement you can click on complement then it will come with these sections will come as complement if I want to give whole item as a complement we can press on complement button then what all items are selected then all the items will be gone as complement. So the complement sections will be uh, given as separate bill. Then the other section, uh, the other option is table. So when uh, before you ordering a KOT, you can you want to select the tables. So you can click on the thing. Uh, then what all and uh, tables are you entered? It will go KOT means the items. Uh, this button is used for like giving kitchen order. This I already told like this is for messaging the section like if I am selected a item like if I want if I want a fish chicken curry and I want to give 
I need that so spicy sections if I want to give a special messages you can if the message is already created uh, in the data in data section it will come here if you want to enter it as news section like medium spicy you can press on one you can insert the one and you can press ok then the message will be inserted on that product the, when we are ordering to the kitchen it will be going to the next section this is the main interface of our TradeEasy Post software.